First of all, he says there's no savior besides him. Right. So what does that mean? There is no savior by, uh, besides him. Correct. He's the ultimate savior. That's all they're saying. Did he send no, Moses? I didn't say ultimate. He, I didn't say did, he send, did he send Moses' brother? Yes or no? Moses Before we even saved. get. Wait, wait a minute, bro. Yes, he was. He was a messiah. Before we right. even get to the before we even get to Yahweh Shah, you gotta deal with all the other messiahs that were sent no, before him. But that's what I'm saying. If he says that there's no savior besides me, then why are there other saviors? Where that's written at? That's the Isaiah, I think it's 45. It's written in where? Seven. Okay, in Isaiah, brother. What difference do it make? What do you mean? What does does Moses come before Isaiah? If if he's saying that, oh, I'm the, come on, he's bro. saying he's the only savior, bro. That not in the context that you thinking he's saying it in. He is the only savior. He's the ultimate savior. Let There's nobody beside the Most High in that in that understanding, brother. Let me read it for you. I know what you going. Where you going? That's a simple logic, my good brother. But I want to get to what he says that when he created, there was there was nobody beside him creating anything. But 